Aaron Kane! It's 1-0. Put it down. 13th in the championship. The takeover happened, as I said it would. People will be... Oh, when, when have we got leads? Now then, people, welcome back to the Just Your Football Show. I hope you are all doing well. Apologies for being 13, 13 minutes late. I didn't get up till half four. As you know, I went for a little nap because I was yawning. And uh, <coughs> Sorry, I made myself some pancakes with some ice cream and some syrup. Nice and healthy. Uh, <laughs> hope you're all doing well. Please do smash a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel as well. Let's see if we can hit 28k. We're getting so much closer. Uh, like the video as well. We've already got 168, which is... No, sorry, that's viewers. Um, we've already got 64, so if we could get that up to 100 quick time, that would be great. Um, as I say as well, please help help me reach 28k. Subscribe, subscribe now and be part of that incredible journey. If you could do that, that would be great. This is... I don't. I genuinely don't know how this game is going to go, um, but you know it's nice to see Snoddy in the Sky Studio. Anyway, big up Snodgrass, by the way. Um, but I'm hoping. Do we want Southampton? Right? Do we want Southampton to win? Do we want a draw? Like to be fair to Russell Martin, Flynn Downs, who've just done interviews on Sky, they've all come out and said this is a must-win. We have to win this game of football. That's their word. So so they knew they know now Southampton are in must win territory. If Ipswich win this, it's goodbye Southampton for the race for automatic and they have to start them preparing, I think, for, for the playoffs. Um so let me know your thoughts in the comments. People saying draw, one apiece, um, point apiece. Um let's have a look at some of the other fixtures. I mean, there were some wild ones. Birmingham beat Preston one nil, Coventry lost to Cardiff, Middlesbrough beat Chef Wednesday. Bristol City beat Plymouth. Rotherham won. Rotherham won a game of football. Can you believe it? Um, they actually got the winner on the 86th minute. So Rotherham have won a game of football. Um, Stoke and Huddersfield was one apiece. Sunderland got battered 5-1. Sunderland are in some bad form. Really bad. Swansea got beat by QPR. And West Brom drew with Watford. Now you're looking at that Watford, uh, Watford result. Since Tom Cleverley came in, and you're saying, okay, they're unbeaten in three. You know, they've got a win against Birmingham and then draws against top six sides. Now you might look at that and say, okay, because they, they didn't have some bad players. They played well against us. Was it just the manager? I was mocking Tom Cleverley, but he's done well. He's done well since he came in. They were 2 0 up, but still, West Brom are a good side. You know, West Brom have. Um, dreams of getting to the Premier League through the playoffs. So, you know, let's not discredit that. Um, but yeah, it, there's some there's some shockers in there. So what has that done to the league table? Let's have a look at the league table. So Norwich, obviously, they lost. West Brom, they lost. So uh, And Coventry lost. And Preston lost. So this is a massive game for Hull tonight, by the way. If Hull win this, obviously, it would put them on... It will put them on 61 and move them within three points of Norwich with the game in hand as well. So all the results today have gone Hull City's way. So if they needed any further sort of impetus for tonight's game, they've got it because Coventry, Preston and Norwich all got beat. So know that they'll be on it, um, you know, against us. In in terms of this one, obviously, Southampton do have nine games left. Um Eight when 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 this kicks off, obviously, um, but they are ten points away from Ipswich. So if they were to win, that cuts it down to seven. They would still have uh, a game in hand. But yeah, it, it, Southampton need to do some. I think as a Leeds United fan, I'm thinking yeah, we want Southampton or a draw, because like I say, if Ipswich win, um, they'll they'll claim top spot again. So let's hope Southampton get some points. Uh, we win tonight, and uh, the the closer it's getting, the more nervous I'm getting as well, to be honest. Because, yeah, we've got to win. Kieran says, do we know about Gruyevna? Not that I'm aware of. Not seen any, anything as of yet. Uh, at the bottom of the table, Huddersfield, Chef Wednesday and Rotherham make up the bottom three. Huddersfield getting a point, you could argue, is pretty huge for them. Um, against Stoke, it puts them within one point of Plymouth with six to go. Chef Wednesday still in with a shout, obviously. Um, they've got 
they've got QPR next. Look at QPR, by the way. They've really pulled away. So Plymouth, Birmingham, not out of it yet. Huddersfield, Chef Wednesday. That's going to go to the wire, I feel, at the bottom. Just like the just like the top is, really. Um, just like the top is. But we'll we'll have to wait and see how it how it develops. But um, yeah. Chef Wednesday are done. I'm not sure, Dowie. They, they still, like I said, all it takes is one win. They could beat QPR next week. We know what the championship's like. So, um, uh, Where have you seen it, pal? I hope you're wrong, by the way. I do hope you're wrong. But, uh, yeah, um, we need him. I think he's the key bit because then everything else will work out fine. If not, as much as we all want Graham midfield, I don't know if Kamara or him... Do the do the six roll to a sufficient level, but we'll wait and see. Um, make sure you check out football prizes as well. Um, football prizes uh, link is in the description. No Leeds United specific prizes being put out yet. Obviously, there was one for tonight's game, um, but you can win yourself many prizes. Not least a uh, Luke Humphreys signed dart shirt. Leeds United fan, of course. Uh, Luke Humphreys. You can win uh, bets. You can win watches. Um, you know that. That star prize, that tag ho watch is 1,500 quid, people. Um, Jamie says, 90% sure he's fit or not, bro? Sorry, just to clarify. Um, what else is there in there? There's a West Ham shirt, some Liverpool shirts, Arsenal versus Luton tickets, um, PlayStation console or Xbox, plus cash prizes, Tyson Fury, Amazon gift card. There's there's loads on offer, folks. You might as well have a go if you've got some spare Easter cash flying around. Please do check them out in the description. Um, if Warnock goes to Plymouth, I hope it relegates Huddersfield. Is that seem to be the, the the general consensus that he could go? Joseph Whiteman says he's fit. I hope Gruyev is fit. Genuinely, if I see Gruyev at what time? Seven o'clock. Ampadu is injured now. The Yorkshireman saying, "Don't be saying this, bro." Fop mob says late April. Who for? No, I don't. I, no, I know non-ton thingy three to three weeks, but um, we'll have to wait and see. If I don't, don't put the old. Is this an April Fool? It better be April Fool. Time's passed anyway. Um, but yeah, I can't lie to you. As soon as um, <laughs> Matt from Rotherham has messaged our um has messaged our uh, uh, the White Rose Rivals pod saying, lads, we won a game. We actually won. I <laughs> love that. Um, yeah, I love that. I'm buzzing for Matt. Buzzing for Matt. Buzzing for Overham. They need something, don't they, before the season ends. Um, they do need something. Man United working on a deal to appoint Southampton's technical director, Jason Wilcox. Former Man City, uh, obviously played at Leeds as well. Former Man City Academy director has a strong reputation in the game. There you go. Hull City as well, fair play to Hull. Uh, have said they'll join Leeds United tonight in uh, remembering the lives of Christopher Loftus and Kevin Spate. Uh, thanks, babe. Um, we They have said we politely ask supporters to be respectful and refrain from bringing turkey flags or shirts with them as we stand with Leeds in remembering uh, the tragic events in Istanbul 24 years ago, which is which is great to see. Um, so happy days. Uh, Dr. Cox just bought two tickets on foot. What for, Dr. Cox? Tell me. What were the prizes you went for? Um, yeah, no worries, Jamie. I know you do, broski. Big up to you. Need your Crocs on for the whole game. Yeah, I, I might. I may change them. Um. Leeds Live said Gruyev not fit. Where where's that, bro? Where have you seen that? I don't know. Let's have a look. I'm just, I'm just searching his name um, on uh, on Twitter. Can't see anything on there. Hmm. Everyone just asking, where is he? Where is he? Big up to Ollie Ward. Big up, my man. I hope you're doing well. 
Go check out his latest video, by the way, with yours truly. It was decent. Uh, very good watch. News Now 24. Okay, let's have a look. Hmm, I can't see anything on there as of yet, bro. They'll have to send us the link. Oh, nice, mate. Well, I hope you win. I hope you get yourself a prize, broski. I hope you get yourself a prize, mate. I do. Tom Troy says Leeds need to win tonight. Definitely, definitely. I can't believe Sunderland have been battered. What f they must be like bottom of the form table, I swear. Let me have a look. Form in the last 10. The 22nd. That win against Cardiff helped them, but my God, they've got seven points in 10 games. Leeds United still top of that form table in the last 10. In the last 15, still top of that form table. In the last 20, still top of that form table. In the last 25, still top of that form table. In the last 30, still top of that form table. There you go, Leeds United cooking. Um, oh, there you go. Well, I hope you get it, Dr. Cox. That's very nice. Nice of you. Yeah, look, look. I agree with you, Yorkshireman. The main, the main cog in the wheel now, as we have established, is Ilya Gruyev. He has to play um, because that then means everyone can go back into their natural positions. Do you know what I mean? Without him, yeah. Um, all right, my mate walked out on the 60th minute, just begging for some for next season. Uh, Yep. Says touch and go for Groyev. Let's hope it's a go. Let's hope it's a go. We can't be dealing with him out. Honestly, we cannot. We cannot. Let's hope Southampton can do us a fifth, but then it's up to us tonight to get the win. Yeah, exactly, Brett. We need to break that Easter hoodoo. Because uh, if we lost, one point over them two games could be enough to derail. Not derail us, but like, leave a big enough gap for us to struggle. Let's say Ipswich won, and then we lost. <laughs> you know? Because it would look bleak then. It would look bleak. Um, Ipswich are at home. We don't know, do we? It's just going to be... We've just got to hope Southampton can do something. What I will say, though, for me, like, Southampton will create chances, and Ipswich aren't the best defensively. So... Horse in a council flat says, Hi, John, like Roman Reigns, I'm head of the stable. Big up to you, mate. I haven't seen you for a while. I always remember your name. I hope you're all well. Uh, all boxed up. Let's hope, yeah, let's hope they do and lose well. Because then Ipswich, then Ipswich have got to go to Norwich, where they notoriously do not do not do well. Jim Towers says, If we lose, get. Nah, no, no, no. Let's not do that. It's not game, ho game over because. When you say we've lost two points, I think we gained a point, and also Leicester lost last time out, so we gained a point on them. Um, yeah, so I, I'm not that. Uh, big up, Stevie. I hope you're doing well, mate. Um, I hope you're doing well. What's odds on 3-3? Three, three? I don't know, mate. Locked into the next two. Keep up the great work, Joe. Go. Big up to you, mate. Because he's that guy. 44% of you have gone for a Southampton win, by the way. 37% Dre and just 20% Ipswich. I think that's more hope more than anything. But what a title race we have on our hands. Let's hope Southampton win. Puts them on 79 with the game in hand, which does mean if they were to win uh, that game in hand, they would only be a point behind us. But that's prior to us playing, of course. So four points if we if we win our game tonight. So let's go. Like Stephen said, there's still 21 points to play for. Double Skull War Gaming says, nil nil draw coming up. Lots of red cards, loads of injuries. Don't mind if I do. That would be the perfect Easter, wouldn't it? Uh, listen, folks, we're on 170 likes, 30 more for 200. So please like the video. Um, ease my anxiety, please, says Ben. Yeah. Um, Southampton will win and Leeds United will win comfortably. Southampton to win. Keep up the good work, Joe. Come on. Come 9.45, we are top. I hope you're right. Um... It's now time to get the momentum rolling at full speed. Unbeaten to the end of the season. Let's do it. Listen, we still are unbeaten. Like, this is the thing, isn't it? Like, we we are still unbeaten. Um, you know, that's what I mean. A draw to us almost can feel like a loss. 
the Huddersfield game was the same, and and so was um, so was uh, Watford on on e- uh, Good Friday was the same then. So yeah, d- be all right, be all right, folks. Trust me. Um, we've got Coventry away on the weekend as well. That'll be tough. So you know, if we don't win this, and then we go to Coventry and we struggle, it's like three games then. And we don't want our blip to be happening at this stage of the season. If you get me, you know. So um, yeah. I don't think we're in a blip, though. I think we win tonight. Come on, Daz Payne says, come on, you Saints. Uh, Hoping for a draw. Saints win or draw, no name. Saints win or draw, I think. Because Southampton have still got some tricky fixtures regardless, you know. Um, I swear they have to play Leicester still, maybe. So, let's have a look. Um... I'm just going to check their fixtures now. They've got Blackburn away, Coventry at home, Watford at home, Preston at home, Cardiff away, Leicester away, Stoke at home, and then us. So they've still got some tricky fixtures in there. They've got fixture pile up as well. Um, so let's not forget that. Yeah, I've seen the Liam Kitchen goal. I've seen the Liam Kitchen goal as well. Um, big up to Emma Hedges, says afternoon to all. Happy Easter. Happy Easter indeed. 3-3 three, three is 66 to 1. Um, there you go. I uh, think there'll be lots of goals. I hope so. I hope so. Um, both teams are pretty strong. Um, Ipswich have got Hladaki, Twan Zabie, Wolford, and Burgess and Davis. Uh, Morsi, Luongo, Jackson, and then Chaplin, Hutchinson, and Moore. Um, and Southampton's is Bazunu. They've got Bree. So no Kyle Walker-Peters. I assume he's injured. Uh, Bednarak, Jack Stevens, Howard Bellis, Flynn Downs, Joe Rebo, Armstrong, Fraser Adams and Armstrong. So some decent players in there as well. Um, it's going to be an exciting game. One that I hope see um, Southampton with a point or better, all three. Uh, Easter weekend was good for me, Matty. I hope it was good for you as well. Listen, we've got 211 likes. Let's get that to 250. Um, at Portman Rose this season... Ipswich have scored 53 goals, the most of any team, but have also conceded 29, which is 19th in the table. So that goes along with what I was saying earlier about that they do concede a lot of goals. Um, so maybe them playing a top six side is actually good. You know, Southampton um, means they'll create. Uh, you would imagine, especially with uh, Armstrong up top, who has a hell of a lot of goals. I think there's only Sammy Schmodix that scored more goals than him this season. Um, 225 likes, just 25 likes for uh, three, 250, sorry, so let's get that done. There's 648 of you watching. It's a big game, this one. Uh, my mum's come home today, Justin, thanks very much for asking. Um, she was able to get about without oxygen and whatnot. She just needs to stay off the cigarettes now. Um, so, yeah, as well as cancer, she, she's got... Um, C- COPD, so, um, yeah, she's come home today, which is a positive, thank you very much for asking, um, doesn't need any oxygen at home, so that's good, uh, Kyle Walker-Peters is on the bench, wow, did he play poorly then in the draw against Borough, did we watch that game, we did, didn't we, we barely spoke, yeah, so, I wonder, um, that was on Friday, wasn't it, well, he's on the bench then, he's not starting, so I think that's where Bree comes in, such a big game this one though, such a big game, The thing is, as well, Southampton, Southampton, no, this is a miss, must win. Um, because they, they're they saying it. Like, Southampton, Russell Martin, the players, Flynn Downs, everybody are all saying this is a mo- must win. So they're not, that could have two two ways. They could go all out or, they, you know, they, it could, the pressure can get too much. Let's hope for Southampton points. Don't forget to smash a like as well, folks. And straight after this one, we do have the Leeds United game as well. So there will be a redirect on for you for our game. Southampton to win 2-1, says JR. We shall be there. Hi, Joe. I think 2-1, says Emma Hayes. We, who, t- who to? CR81, big up to you. I'm just waiting for the game to start now. Southampton cannot afford to drop a point. Yeah, I agree with you, mate. There we go. We're underway, folks. And Southampton has got us kicked off. Um, I'm going to go for a two-all, Carl. I'm going to go two-all, mate. Um, hope Southampton nick a win. We, we will be there. Uh, 40 more likes for 300. Keep smashing them likes up, folks. We're underway now. 
And Shea Adams has gone back to Harwood Bellis. And it is Bree, I think, who's at right back. Bednarak. Back to his keeper, Bazunu. I really don't rate Bazunu, by the way. I know a few people do, but not for me. Definitely not. He is Armstrong. Up against Jackson. Been given as an Ipswich for Twan Zabi. I think Twan Zabi being used a lot more than they would have liked because they always played Harry Clark, didn't they? But he's having to play right back now that Clark got that injury. Twan Zabi with the throw, headed in by Kiefer Moore. Yeah, this is uh, it's on a knife edge. On a knife edge. There's Bednarak carrying the ball out into midfield. Nice, Adams. Adams moves it to Joe Rebo. Armstrong, who's on the right-hand side of the front three. There's a Rebo. Do you know what? I'd like a Southampton thumping win. It's just about catching those that are above us, isn't it? Forget what Southampton could do with the game in hands. Just let's hope Southampton batter them. That's the plan. That's the plan. I've just made up my mind. Southampton battered. Uh, sorry, Hipswich battered. Let's hope. we done it against them. Why can't Southampton? Southampton on their day are a great side. And they will leave chances. There's Ryan Fraser back to bed in Iraq. Southampton with a lot of possession early doors. Arebo, can he win the header? He can't leave Davis Will. And Hutchinson gives it him. There's Luongo. That's a good challenge, ref, man. The refs have been very soft today. They better be like that for us. Because I tell you what. We got a red card, a silly red card in the last game against Hull. Free kick given by Armstrong on Luongo. So Wolfenden. Burgess out to Twanzebe, Axel Twanzebe. I love that name, by the way, Axel. There's, oh, ball by Chaplin cut out. Looking for Jackson, goes back to Bazunu. Jackson doesn't normally start, does he? So, has there been an injury picked up? Bazuno goes long. Looking for Armstrong. Won by Wolfenden. Or Burgess, sorry. Keep your comments coming in. Don't forget to smash the likes as well. Uh, we are 17 away from 250, so smash them likes. More tries to cross it. Headed out by Flynn Downs, I believe. And that will be a throw into to Ipswich early doors. I don't know much about Brie, other than it's a cheese, but Leif Davis with the throwing coming, the assist master, Burgess coming up for it. Who else is in there? Burgess, Jackson, Kiefer Moore. Kiefer Moore's the one. Big throw. Davis, big head out there. Easy header for Howard Bellis. And it'll go for a throw again to Ipswich. Draw for me, Joe Saints. Win and have, we have to... Nah, don't, just focus on what's in front. Um, Tragic Price says, watching you whilst waiting f outside Ellen Road for the gates to open. That is the way to go. Big up to you. Uh, do we really want Saints to win? Though? Yeah, no, nah, I do. Yeah. Big up to Joe Woodward walking. The dog's listening to you, Saints, and Leeds win, please. Yeah. I get that it can give Southampton confidence, but they're behind us, right? This is the way I see it. They're behind us, so let's let's focus on um, what's in front, what we need to catch. Aidan Kavanagh says, hardest working man on YouTube. Subscribe to his channel. Yes, please do, folks. Like the, uh, like the chat says, uh, help us reach 28K. Let's get on that journey. Um... We have 27,875, so we are 120, 125 away, yeah. 125, maths ain't my strong point. Anyway, here comes a set piece. It's going to be Bree to take. Bree lifts it up, headed out by Twanzebe. Here's Armstrong. Stuart Armstrong, that is, for Southampton. 
Oh, God, just banged the desk. Norwich were useless. Let's hope Southampton are better. Yeah, Norwich were great. I think I think Wagner got his his tactics wrong, to be honest. Although even when they went behind, they, did, they didn't look good going forward. But I expected more, to be honest. So I think they just tried. They were too defensive for me. They should have had a goal. They were in form, but... Eh. Five minutes in, still nil-nil here. No, no big chances of no... Oh, I tell you what, the Armstrongs give it away. Chaplin, Jackson has a chance for Ipswich, it's cut back, Moore tries to get a flick on it but can't and Bazuno has a chance to send it upfield for Southampton, Armstrong flicks it onto Adams but they've won it again here, this is good from Ipswich but now here's Stuart Armstrong, he's got grass to run into. Jack Stevens. I swear Jack's just Jack Stevens, has he been playing left back? Or is that another injury? Is that another injury? I'm not too sure. Goes back here to Bazunu. Six minutes on the clock. Bednarak. Stuart Armstrong, nice. Jack Stevens there into. Charlie Adam, Armstrong with the strike, it's blocked though, up to Hutchinson, there's Luongo, Chaplin tries to flick it round Bednarak, good challenge that as well by uh, by Bree, Southampton doing alright, they've got a lot of possession of the ball at, at this moment in time, let's have a boring nil-nil, no let's hope not, I don't want it to be boring, I'll take a draw but not boring, it's like pulling teeth then. Stuart Armstrong gets round Twenzebe. Can't take the ball with him, though, and Jackson's back supporting, but his clearance isn't great. Oh, it's offside, I think. It's given us offside, so... So it'll be a free kick. I really dislike that dude, man. What's his name? Russell, Charlie, Adam, Alexandra Martin, or whatever his name is. Ooh, get up, get up. Luongo's just throwing himself to the floor there. Armstrong. Stuart Armstrong goes out wide. He is Ryan Fraser. Back to Armstrong. Oh, chance. Flynn Downs drags it wide, though. Flynn Downs just drags his shot wide. Should do better. Should probably hit the target. No real pressure. Just a poor effort in the end. 770 here watching live. We've got 328 likes. Let's get that to 350. If you haven't liked the video, please do. 83% possession for Southampton. On top in the early exchanges. Haven't created anything of note, though. But Here is Twan Zerby. Finds Kiefer Moe, then pops it out to Leif Davis. Leif Davis has Hutchinson ahead of him. Decides against it. And there's a run for Luongo from deep. And he's found there. It's a decent run. He's up against Howard Bellis. Can he pick out a blue shirt? He can. And it's a strike from Davis. But well wide. Poor effort. It was a decent run. But a poor shot from Leif Davis. First time drags it well wide. 351 likes, folks. Get them likes smashed. Let's get it up to 400. We'll set the target at 1,000 on the stream. Here's Armstrong, Stuart Armstrong into Stevens. And then back to Bednarak. Are they playing three at the back with Bednarak in front? With, sorry, not with Bednarak in front. With Jack Stevens in front. Is it Bednarak, Howard, Bellis and Bree? I think so. Twan Zabie's done well, wins possession. I tell you what, so is Jackson to keep it in. Little step over Jackson, cross, key for more. Touch back. Oh, he tries to give it back to uh, Twan Zabie, but there could be a chance here on the counter, and Adam Armstrong's just hit it over the top for, for Adams to chase. But I call him Charlie Adams earlier, you know. What's his name? Why have I had a brain fart? I wanted to do my football club for time. 
Shea Adams. Why did I forget his name? I called him Charlie Adams earlier. I just clicked. Big up top, Yank. See, this is what happens when you just have brain, brain farts. How mad's that? I wanted Shea Adams for a while, and then I calling him Charlie Adams. Mental. 372 likes, folks. Let's get that to 400. Here's Hladaki in goal for Ipswich. 10 minutes played, no chances yet. Out to Twan Zabi, chest onto his boot. Nice. Ball into Chaplin. Chaplin can't keep it in. I didn't think anyway, but Southampton have got the ball. Shea Adams. Here's Downs. They're definitely playing free at the back, aren't they? Bednarak into Downs. Downs turns. Shea Adams back to Downs. They want to get it out to a rebo. They've got it out to the right, though, with Bree. Here's a rebo. I think he's set them up well here. There's Russell Martin. Bednarak out left to Fraser. Fraser up against Twan Zabi. Good cross. Headed out, though, by Burgess. Chaplin brings it down. Well done, Flynn Downs. Takes it off him, and then Bednarak gives it out to Bree. This is good from Southampton, to be honest. Positives. A reboot. Yeah, man. I like this from Southampton. How are you folks seeing it in the chat? Well done. How are Bellis, though? Oh, he's just been dispossessed, and there's a chance. Hutchinson gets away from Bree. Chaplin into Kiefer Moore. Kiefer Moore to Jackson. Cross. Cleared. I was just praising Southampton, and then Ipswich uh, won it. Here's Luong. Oh, it's Morsi. Sorry, Morsi. Out wide to Davis. We know he can deliver. What a fucking goal. What a goal. Leaf Davis. With an absolute wonder strike. I thought he'd cross it. I genuinely thought he'd cross it, but he hasn't crossed it. He smashed it. Smashed it into the net. The keeper had no chance. Leif Davis puts it, switch 1-0 up. What a strike. And I was just saying how well Southampton were. How well they played. And they give it away silly. I think it's Harwood Bellis. Amari Hutchinson gets challenged by Bree, but he can't quite get there. Kiefer Moore there into Jackson and Jackson's cross falls kindly. And here's, look at this from Morsi. He picks out Davis beautifully. He's onside as well, folks. He's definitely onside and he just rifles that. The keeper has no chance. Although Bazunu should do better. Bazunu should probably do better, but you can't take anything away from that. Pick it out, as Andy Featherston says in the chat. It's a, do you know what? It's a great ball by Morsi as well. Look at that, it's a tight angle. Keeper has no chance. Bang. Pazunu though, nowhere. Nowhere. But it's a great it's a great finish. There you go. He is Bazunu is Bobbins, can't lie. F repaying him in he after his uh, after his own goal. Uh, on a number of occasions. Yeah, so there you go. He's repaying them. Repaying them for that. Ipswich 1, Southampton 0. Here's Shea Adams. Shea Adams to Arebo. Oh, they're in here, Southampton. It's Armstrong. Arebo. It's going to fall for Shea Adams. No offside given. It's one all. He looked offside to me. But Shea Adams with an instant response. Get in. Big up to Shea Adams, formerly known as Charlie Adams. It's one all. He looked offside to me, I can't lie to you. He looked offside. It's your man, Joe Adams, it is. He looks offside to me. Shea Adams was involved in the build-up. Arebo, don't say Leaf played him on. Let's have a look. Armstrong with the chance, passes it back to Arebo. Oh, yeah, Leaf Davis. Leaf Davis plays him on. He's definitely onside, folks. Leaf is in no man's land. Leaf is in no man's land. Come on, you big Scottish beauty. You big Scottish beauty, Shea Adams. Hladaki, can he get there? And there you go. She Adams finds the back of the net. And that is one apiece down at Portman Road. Big up. Get in. Big up to Shea. One all. Game on. Leif Davis, good at one end. Plays him on side at the other. One apiece. And Ipswich go back into second. Sit down, Kieran McKenna. This will do us nicely. 
Exciting game, folks. Happy days. Happy days. Make sure you smash them likes. We've got over a thousand viewers, folks, and we are on um, 400 likes. Let's get that to 450 if we can, folks. Southampton with the tails up now. Armstrong into a rebo. A rebo, then into Flynn Downs. Flynn Downs played well. Oh, he's t yes, that's definite free kick. And it's going to be a yellow card, actually, for Morsi, the captain. He does like a yellow card. It was a free kick. He was away from him, was Flynn Downs. Flynn Downs started well. Um, great accent. I did it well, yeah? Oh, good. Oh, good. That's fine, then. I thought I'd, I, I thought I'd get, get hammered, but there you go. Uh, 423 likes. Let's get that to 450, folks. There's over 1,000 people watching now, so let's get that. Let's get that up, please. If you haven't liked the video, make sure you subscribe as well. We're on the road to 28,000 subscribers. Uh, be part of that incredible journey. We want to get to 30 before the end of the season. It's looking tight, but if we can, that'd be great. Um, we've got 133 subscribers away, so I reckon if you subscribe, probably could get there. Can't lie to you. Um, so a free kick for Southampton. You have Stuart Armstrong, Bree, and Bednarak stood over it. Bree's taken a few. I know normally he wouldn't play, I don't think, anyway, Carl Walker-Peters, but it looks like Southampton have gone with the back three. And I've liked their, their, the way that he set them up. I said that, but as I said, that Ipswich went and scored against the runner play, I thought, because Southampton were getting on top. Um, but it's going to be Bree to take this. Bree, cross. Ooh. Ooh, keeper was concerned. I think he was having a go at goal, or is it a corner, folks? Might be a corner. Let's have a look. Bree. Mm. Is it a corner? Or... No. Goal kick. I don't know if he's looking for a player to commit and try win something, but nothing happening. 465 likes. Let's get that to 500, folks. We are uh, just 35 away now. 35 away. Hladaki looks for the run. I think, was it? Deef, yeah, D D Deef Davis. Deef Davis. Deef Davis. Bazunu puts it on the deck, rolls it out to Bednarak. Bednarak goes long. Never going to win that up there, is he? Shea Adams against Wolfenden. Bree lets it run across his body and goes back to Harwood Bellis. Ipswich now pressing on top. Here's a rebote. Back to Bree. And here's Jan Bednarak for Southampton. Going as we wanted, you know. Going as we wanted after an early scare. Oh, they've given it away in the centre of the park again, though. Oh, Morsi Luongo, sorry, he's had a shocker. He's tried to give it to a Hutchinson, but the pass was poor. Flynn Downs goes back to Bree, and there's Howard Bellis. Bazunu. Southampton happy to just knock it between the defenders. Jack Stevens into Shea Adams. Back to Jack Stevens. It seems like Jack Stevens has sort of like got a free roll, man. Shea Adams down the line, that's decent. And here's Ryan Fraser. He's got Armstrong and Armstrong at the back post. Yes, there's two. Aribo touching side to Shea. Pass Aribo. He puts Morsi on his back. Shea Adams. Armstrong turn and strike. And it'll be a corner ball, folks. Southampton corner. Southampton starting to turn the screw. For me, Southampton looked the better side anyway, folks, prior to Ipswich goal. Um, five likes away, folks. Five likes away from 500. If you haven't liked the video, like the video now for me, please. It massively helps the channel. If you could do that for me, it would be great. What we're saying about WrestleMania next weekend, folks, it's going to be a barnstormer, I tell the, tell the. Anyway, it's a corner ball. Oh, no corner. That's a strange one. Don't even think we've had one yet, which I'm quite surprised at, but I thought that was one for sure. Southampton on top. Bednarak, Kiefer Moore, trying to win the ball back off him. Bednarak does really well. Goes back to Harwood. Bellis, 20 minutes on the clock. Here's Bree. 
Back to Bazunu. Think that we might hear that a lot, you know. Oh, I tell you what, though. Jack Stevens nearly got caught on it there by Morsi, but uh, managed to find Howard Bellis. Goes into Stevens. Armstrong down on the left. There's Shea Adams. Challenged by Wolfenden and a free kick given for the foul by Wolfenden on Shea Adams. Referee's blown up. I think there's a bit of uh, handbags going on. So it's going to be a free kick to Southampton. Thousand people watching. Big up to you all. If you haven't already liked the video, we've got 510. 40 more likes for 550. Get that like smashed for me. Morsi needs to calm down. He's already received the yellow. Free kick. Bedner act to take. Jack Stevens getting some instructions, I think, from uh, Russell Alexander, the great Martin. Ipswich fans wanting Bednarat to hurry up with it. Telling Chaplin to get away, I think. I don't know. It's not five yards. <laughs> They've taken it now. Go back to Howard Bellis. Bree to Joe Rebo. 74% possession for Southampton, folks. They have been on top. Like I say, though, six shots, but only one on target. Oh, Bazunu plays a bit of a hospital pass into Stevens, but he goes back, and here's Bree on the right-hand side for Southampton. Howard Bellis, Bednarak, Bazunu. That's ugh, it's like watching Leicester. <laughs> I mean, I can't say how we do the fucking same. It just gets a bit boring, doesn't it? Armstrong with the throw. Nice, Shea Adams. Ah, he's trying to get Fraser away. Poor pass. Morsi. There's Kiefer Moore and Hutchinson waiting for Leif Davis to come into his picture. Leif Davis has. He's got Chaplin and Jackson coming in. There's the box. Well, I don't know. Don't know what happened there. Don't know if it took a deflection, but it's gone straight through to Bazunu, folks. There's Stuart Armstrong getting away from Jackson. Great ball. Great ball. Oh, yes! 2-1, what a ball from Armstrong to Armstrong. As soon as it left his boot, what a ball, I said. What a ball! And he gets there. There was a last-ditch challenge, I think, from Leif Davis. But Leif Davis, he cannot defend. He cannot defend. And that is a finish and half by the championship's second leading goal, goal scorer, Armstrong. Jack Stevens now receiving... Some instructions, but this ball from Stuart Armstrong is a beauty. He gets past Jackson here and he can see Adam Armstrong running into his picture. He's seen it, he's seen the picture. Leaf Davis out of position, he cannot defend. Last ditch slide, but Adam Armstrong already was there. Killer, back of the net. It is now 2 1 to Southampton, and that is what you want if you are a Leeds United fan. That is what you want if you're a Southampton fan. But that's all from Adam Armstrong. The pass was inch perfect, and Adam Armstrong just had to pass it into the net. But Leif Davis, a bit like Dr. Cox says, a bit like Furpo, cannot defend. Cannot defend. And there you go. Leif can't defend. Yeah, man. Well, let's let's not pretend we're giving Jesse any credit for that. We still should have kept him. He's still, because we've got Furpo, we've got, you know, Sam Byram. Leif, I'm, I'm just saying he can't defend, though, right? Um... There you go. Great, great finish. Great finish. Um, and 2 1, and this is what you want. Um, let's have a look at the um, 26 minutes on the clock. It's Ipswich 1, Southampton 2. Let's have a look what that does to the table. So, Southampton would move. Oh, they've given it away here. Luongo gets dispossessed, though. I reckon Southampton could get a few, you know. It could get a little bit like the Leeds United games, just because they will create a lot of chances against Ipswich. Um, six points behind Leeds now, with a game in hand. Um, obviously, if they win that game in hand, it's cut to three. Um, we still will play, though, yeah, so... I don't know how that works. If they won both their game in hands, would they be on the same points as us? 
oh, we play tonight, and that puts some for it. That's two. All oh, right, okay, no, they'd still be three behind us, right? I think that's right. They deserve to be in front. They do, mate. Yeah, I agree with you. Southampton have been the better side. Um, oh, chance. What's this? Shea Adams. Back to Flynn Downs. Flynn Downs. Cross. Twanzebi. Oh, nearly gets there. What's the chat saying? Um, no, what? Depends if we win. Yeah, if we win... If we win tonight, that's six points, right? And they have, they would have two games in hand. Is that right? Sorry, man. This is I should. This should be easy maths. So we win. That puts on. They, they will have two games left, and we will have eighty-six, which would put them on. They'd be nine points. So if they won both their games, they'd be three points behind us. Right. Okay. That's fine. But they'd have to win both of them. Right. Thank you, everyone. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just thinking if they win their two games, that would put them on 83, wouldn't it? Yeah, true. Yeah, big up, Russ. All good. Sorry, maths isn't my strong point, as you know. Uh, but big up, 2-1 to Southampton. 2-1 to Southampton. And to be honest, there's only been 26 minutes played. It's it's mad. It's mad. Cheers, Patrick. There's one on my computer as well. So we've just played just up to half an hour coming up to. There's three goals scored, as you would expect with these two sides. Um, from what's this here? Leeds squad confirmed for Hull City with five players w ruled out. Oh, well, we know that anyway, don't we? So it's a complicated task we have to take the eye also to have assess how Sam Byram is again for Monday Junior is hopefully in a good start we have to set how ready Liam is we have to wait for the outcome and then mate Roberts, Nonto, Strauch and Dallas will definitely not feature you know, I think Gruyev could make it let's wait and see I hope he does man let's wait and see thank you for that Reese, bro let's hope he does 574 likes folks so we've just got 26 likes away from 600, keep liking the video, please. Be great if you could do that for me. Here comes Bree. Cross. I need to get my post-match crew um, ready now. Just remembered. Tanzebi puts it out. Throw in. I know a lot of them will be at the game. I think Jer's at the game, actually. Seventy-five percent possession for Southampton. They're killing them. It's a bit like Leeds, man. I know Ipswich have scored, but sort of against the runner play. Oh, he's done well there, Armstrong. Hey, how's that not a free kick? It's gone out to leave Davis this space now, though. Space for Davis. We know he can be lethal here. He's got Chaplin and Hutchinson coming into the picture, but Jackson at the back post. Chaplin, terrible shot. Really terrible shot. Here's a rebot out to Armstrong. Coming up to 30 minutes, folks. Moore's hurt his back here. Could Moore be up? I tell you what, if Moore's out, that's not that's not a good look. 
Not a good look at all. You can hear the telly a bit, no worries. I'll just turn it down a bit. Yeah, hopefully that's a bit better. Moore looks like he might have done his back here, folks. It's not as if he's if he's gone down in the thirtieth minute as well. Kiefer Moore would be a massive loss for Ipswich, genuinely. Massive loss. Yeah, we could, Stevie. I can't lie to you. Here's Morsi and uh, Morsi and Luongo having a chat here with Kieran McKenna. Yeah, Joe's at the game. Let's have a look. Morsi stretching for it. What's this? That, yeah, that is a foul, that. I can't lie. Ellis says Russell Martin is fuming. I'm not sure why. What was he fuming for? It was a free kick. More. He's up on his feet. Should be all right. Oh, Russell Martin, that's all he does is complain. That's all he does. Ipswich three injuries short of a normal team. All bullshit for a timeout, says Vega. Do you reckon? Do you reckon that's what was going down? Here's Flynn Downs. As the time draws closer, the more, um, the more. I don't know, the more nervous I become as the time draws closer. The more nervous I become. Just got an email from JD Sports saying I won a ticket for the Leeds United podcast meet and greet. Nice. I didn't even realise that was a thing. Big up. Here's Bednar acting to Bree, Brita Aribo. Yeah, Vega says new tactical approach coming, yeah. Yeah, I'm on. Probably. Listen, there's 1,100 people watching. Big up to you all. Uh, 631 likes. If you haven't already liked the video for me, here is Amari Hutchinson tries to dink it up to Jackson. Jackson's going to put the cross into the box. Lee Davis goes up for it. It's headed out, though, by Bree. And well done. Aribos took it off of Hutchinson. Gives it to Armstrong. Off the ball. Foul, potentially. Ref says no, but ball sent forward, but it's straight to Ladaki. There's Morsi. Ipswich lose this. Leeds United have got to fucking win tonight. Got. There's a lot of pressure on it now. Even I'm starting to feel the pressure. Thinking if they lose, man, we've got to take the impetus. Because Ipswich play Norwich next. Who have we got next? Who have we got next, folks? What's our fixture? I don't even know. Should not. Oh, I do. It's Coventry, man. It's Coventry. It's Coventry. Here's Bazunu. Coventry away will not be easy either. When's their FA Cup tie, actually? I'm just going to check this. I don't think it'll probably impact us, will it? I think maybe it's the week after. Ah, oh, nah. Kiefer Moore's done, folks. Kiefer Moore is done. Oh, they don't play till 21st, so it's not going to affect us. That's my money down drain. I had him for one shot on target for feck's sake. He's done his back in Bedner at with a little push. I didn't I mean It's all good, man. It's all good. Don't worry about it. Big Keith is done out here. This is positive for, for well, the rest of the... Because he's key, man. He's scored a lot of goals for them. I'm trying to cash out. Oh, they've let me cash out. 
I mean, I've lost eight pounds, but they've let me cash out. That's a bit mad, isn't it? Bet three six five, let me cash out, and he's getting subbed. <sighs> Got away with that one, I tell ya. Ali Al Hamadi. Can you believe they've let me cash out there? They must have. They must have not been quick on the old take there. But m more being injured is is massive. Yeah. Yeah, I was lucky, Stevie. I can't lie. Um, Ali Al Hamadi. Yeah, Stephen. I said more, and I got laughed out. I got laughed out. Um, but yeah. Ali Al Hamadi is a handful though, has scored, but um yeah, um Yeah, let's hope it's serious. I'm sorry, Keith, for more. I know you're part of the Welsh brethren and that, but listen, Ipswich goals by subs. Ali Al Hamadi has got four. He's got four, so um yeah. <laughs> Charity cash out, Lord Shergaff. Tell him, man, I'll take it. Um, yeah, that's what I mean, Dale. I'm surprised. I'm su surprised. I'm surprised I managed to get that. But there you go. I didn't, Graham. I didn't lump on your three-three, mate. Throwing by Twanzebi, looking for Ali Al. Ooh, they want a penalty. It looked a bit dodge. Referee says no. Armstrong flicks it forward. Um, yeah, it's a big loss for Ipswich that though, especially with Norwich up next as well. Um, big moment for uh, Ali Al Hamadi, but. We shall see free kick given to Ipswich for a foul on uh, Morsi. 37 minutes on the clock. Ipswich 1, Southampton 2. You're right, James, it is, mate. I can't lie. It is. Here's Wolfenden to Twanzebe. Twanzebe trying to get round Fraser. About seven minutes till half time. Nick says you'd have got your money back because he was sub before our time. I don't think so, bro. As soon as sub, gone, no. You're you saying I'd have got 20 quid back instead of 12. Don't say that. Big up to Leonardo Strada. <laughs> Mate, how's it already 6 p.m.? I know. It's mad, isn't it? Be our game soon. More off. Yeah, Darren Moore is off the pitch. Leeds United, we've had a tweet from Leeds United, we're in the world, will you be following or That's it. That's all. We just need to know, um, we need to know that, uh, oh, let's have a look across, we need to know that Gruyev's in the team, that's all we're waiting for. No worries, Leonardo. David Moyes has been speaking about Calvin. Uh, he says, Calvin Phillips is a human being, what he needs is support and people to help him. We will support Calvin. He's a really good player, and I believe we can still make something out of the time we've got him here for. Good man. Good man. We shall see. <coughs> Moved out to the left-hand side. Here's Fraser. Fraser gives it to Armstrong. Not the best pass. Quite a poor pass, to be honest. Yeah, Sky bet refunds certain bets if an injury forces a sub. Okay, maybe. As long as Cooper isn't playing, I'm happy. I don't think he will be, mate. I don't think he will be, so no worries for you there. Listen, folks, we're about 20, 15 likes, sorry. Uh, 50, no, 25 likes away from 700. Like the video if you can, please. Coming up to the 40th minute. Um... Phil says, don't give the monkeys about KP. That's fine, bro. I do. We're all in. Yeah. Um, no, I, I agree with you, Lord Shergaff. It get worse than that from me. Um, I see Nick. No worries. No worries. I don't think I'd have got more than 12 anyway. Here's me thinking I was... Uh, thinking I was buzzing and that. Here is Arebo. Arebo's still got the ball. Tries to get it through to Shea Adams, but it's cleared by Ipswich. Oh, handball. Yeah, it looked like handball. 
Yeah, exactly, J-Dog. He's, he's, uh, he's, he's key, isn't it? Oh, Fraser's going to get there. Poor from Hladaki. Here's Stuart Armstrong. A third is massive. Here is Stevens. Stevens, poor pass. Chaplin. Nice, does well. Goes into Luong, Luongo now. Challenged by Flynn Downs. Howard Bellis carries the ball. Aribo. Morsi slipped over. Aribo still got the ball. Southampton looking good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. By far the better side. Uh, 688 likes, folks. Let's get that like to 700, please, if we can. Switch a play from... Howard Bellis into Fraser. And ball give over, man. He's about five foot. He can't help that. See this though, he was um he was rightly sent off though. He was rightly sending off. I do not want this unprofessional at our club again. Who are you on about, Stephen? Are you on about Calvin? What are you going on about? That's wild. Do you think he's unprofessional or what? Three more likes, folks, for 700 there. Hit it, as I said it. Big up to you all. Let's get 750 up next. Here's Wolfenden. Aribo's done well. Adam Armstrong into Stuart Armstrong. Can he set him up now? Fraser! Oh, oh it should have been 3-1. You're talking inches away there from making it 3-1 with Stuart Armstrong. Almost three. You think he's unprofessional, Stephen? I don't know what you're on about, bro. Everyone's entitled to their opinion, but you're wrong. He was onside as well. Good ball by Stewart. Oh, Fraser, inches wide. Yes, exactly, bro. Gav, exactly. That is true. And so if we win tonight, we'll have picked up four points when the rest have picked up threes. Oh, Southampton would have picked up four as well if it stays like this. But yeah, we'd have done all right. We'd have done all right. Jack Diamond says, Plastic fans, what are you? Ten. Tell them, Jack. <laughs> Jack's coming for you. Leads the hole up at eight o'clock. Throw in. Well, I'll tell you what, Shea Adams there just volleys it back. Flicking the bird to a fan is acceptable. Yes, it is when you're getting abused, yeah? Would you be able to take abuse if Jumba's just shouting it at you all the time? Why not? 722 likes, for. Let's get some more likes on there. Get that to 750 before half time. We've got like two minutes plus added. I reckon it might be about three minutes at a time. Here's Stuart Armstrong. Tries to come in field, but Jackson takes it off him with ease. Jackson into Connor Chaplin, Morsi. Morsi does well to get away from his man, but across comes, oh, Flynn Downs, and he's, oh, he might get a second yellow there. Give him a second yellow ref, get Morsi off. He always seems to dodge him. I think Southampton are asking for it. If Fark starts with Cooper, I'm not watching it, says Ellis. What? <laughs> Why? You do, do you hit the legend that much? Come on now. So, Morsi loses it. Oh, and he, he does. It is a foul. It is a foul. Leaves his leg on purpose. Gets away with the yellow, though. He always seems to dodge it. Mick McCarthy in the crowd. Hey, up, Mick. Barnsley. I do like Mick. Can't lie. 30 seconds left. Mick a Leeds fan as well. Or is he a Barnsley fan? I know he's from Barnsley, but is he a Leeds fan? I think he might be. Just coming up to the 45th minute. Seven minutes. Wow. Yeah, Juki, you can't. No, yeah, that that's totally, um, yeah, just totally goes against the, the reason for Mock, doesn't it? <laughs> really. Marching on together. <laughs> Look, you can't say, Ellis, marching on together... But then say if Cooper plays that, yeah, n no one's saying he's not plastic his shelf life. I feel like I have to qualify that. But you can't say marching on together if you're saying if he plays, I'm not going to watch. 
<laughs> hey, mad. McCarthy has looked 70 since he was 40. I know, tell me about it. Seven minutes out of time for the Keith, Keith and Moore stuff. Outside of that, I don't think there has been much. Six more likes for 750, folks. Get them likes plus smashed. Splashed? Yeah, you can get them splashed, smashed. It all counts. Stevens loses out, brings down Chaplin. Don't give him a yellow card there, ref, because you didn't book thing for his second. I'm, I'm feeling another coffee at half time. Chaplin's just thrown himself to the ground, by the way, there. Here's Burgess. Square into Wolfenden. And don't forget to uh, smash a like on the video, folks, if you haven't already. Hopefully, we'll start to see some uh, squad news start to. Uh, Drip through in a second. Ali Alhamidi chases the ball. Bazuno comes out to get it, though. Keep smashing them likes, folks. 1,200 of you watching now. A rebote. Ali Alhamidi's given a free kick away, folks. <sighs> You alright, bud? Nobody's in here with me, you aren't you? Hmm? Yeah. I know. Free kick taken long. Headed by Leaf Davis. Who scored a wonder strike to get Ipswich off to a great start. But here comes Southampton. Stuart Armstrong into Shea Adams. Could there be a chance before half time? He gets past Luongo. Goes out to Adam Armstrong, the goal scorer. He's had a shot. And I tell you what, that's not that bad of an effort. Two minutes played of seven minutes added on. So still five to go, folks. Yeah, exactly, Jimmy. We can all agree, definitely. No, he definitely wouldn't. It's wild. Ipswich haven't looked great at all, if I'm honest. Here's a rebo. Wait a minute. Jack Stevens into Shea Adams. Back to Stevens. Shea Adams. Good football this by Southampton. A third before half time would be massive. A rebo. Get down, son. You can't come up because I'm working. You know this. It's been all Southampton, though, in terms of possession and everything. Ipswich's goal sort of came against the run of play and error, to be honest. But outside of that, it's been all Southampton. They've had possession of the football. Bazunu. Styles makes fights, don't they? And uh, Southampton... Have, what was the reverse fixture? Does anyone know the result in the reverse fixture? Did uh, did Southampton win that one as well? Or? Twan Zabi with the throw. Looking for Ali Al Hamadi. Oh, he's lost out though. And give it straight to Stuart Armstrong. Shea Adams gets it taken off him. Connor Chaplin. Again, Southampton come away with the ball. Ipswich not able to create anything. Chaplin's done well, but that's a good... Defending from Shea Adams. Does anyone know the reverse fixture? 2-1. Two, 2-1 one. Two, one Ipswich. Wow. Um, Kyle may be a little bit. No, nah, I think we'll win, though. Um, yeah, exactly. Anyone who doesn't think he would Im improve us is, is mad. So it was actually 1-0 Ipswich. Mm, okay. And that was at the Den. Not the Den. The Dell. Bednarak. Here's Bree. Bazunu. Armstrong cuts inside. Tries to fizz one out to Adam. That's a lovely ball as well, that proper daisy cutter. There's Adam Armstrong. 
Gets a deflection. That'll be a corner ball. Got two minutes left of added time, folks. It's a corner ball for Southampton. Don't forget to smash those likes. We've got 769, so not too far away now from 800 likes. Bree to take this. It's a decent knock, but it's headed out. Only as far as a rebo. Here's Stuart Armstrong. Armstrong, he's onside, surely. Oh, Jack's... Oh, he was offside, actually. Jack St Stevens looked like he beat the offside trap, but his effort was, was poor anyway. He's been poor. Yeah, he was offside as well, actually, Jack Stevens. His effort was poor anyway. Good save by Hledake. Leif Davis goes back to Burgess. Hledake goes long. Headed as Chaplin, but Bree on the cover. Got about 30 seconds left, folks. Jack Stevens. Down the line, Shea Adams to chase. Headed. There you go, it's half time, folks. Half time, Southampton 2, Ipswich 1. I I can't see at the minute. Nah, I'm, Mike's all good. Mike's all good, Ross. I can't see how the minute, how Ipswich get anything from this, if I'm honest. Um, so... Yeah, I don't understand. Um, Sean Healy, what's he saying? What's he saying? Where would KP play for Leeds? Can't see him getting into the first eleven like him and all, but Biel's not made him yet. We've heard that all before. I know. That's what you all say. It's all good. Calvin is good. Um, yeah, so 1,200 people watching. Uh, big up to you all. Uh, please do smash a like on the video. Um, we've got 786, so we've got 14 likes away from 800. Um, yeah, sound is all good at my end. It's really turned up, so I don't know why it would be uh, lower. Um, no worries, Matthew. They were gifted earlier on by Christopher Spofford Chapel. Um, listen, this is going as we want. Um, Stephen says, Joe, look, Southampton look class, EPL class. I wouldn't go that far. Um, but yeah, listen, at the end of the day, they're, um, they're in control. They're in control. Um, they can't get near it, so we'll wait. We'll wait and see. Um, We'll wait and see how it transpires, but I think if you ask me that that Southampton win this game, I think this they win this game. Just realised I've not had my um, phone on charge, which isn't great. So let's uh, get that back on charge. Um, Southampton are by far the better side. They are, mate, aren't they? I think they're in complete control, so more of the same, please. Um, what I am going to do, folks, is just quickly take uh, a break just to, to make myself um, a coffee just for the second half, obviously. We, uh, we've got Leeds game to come as well. We'll know, we'll know um, in 34 minutes. Um, we'll know in 34 minutes what the Leeds United lineup will be. Hopefully, Gruyev will be there because he's the key part of this. Um, but, yeah, please all smash the like and... Um, we will be there. Okay, so smash a like on the video. I'm just going to quickly put an advert there. I'll see you in two, folks. Big up. Um, big up to you all.
Now then, people, we are back. Just made myself a quick cuppa. I hope you're all doing well. Let's see what the chat was saying. Um, let's go back a bit. Um, someone says a fraud. Who is a fraud? 3-1 Saints. Looks like it could go that way. Um, they do look very good, Stephen. They are a good side, though, on their day, but they're just a bit inconsistent for me. Um, yes, potentially. Like I say, if, if Leeds win, we've actually got the most points, us and Southampton, out of the top four over the international break. So, Saints win and we win. Happy days. Um, no, they would be three points behind Yorkshire Perlo. Um Aaron says Melier, Shackleton Road and Ampadu Furpo, Kamara Gray, Somerville, Georgie, James Joseph, my eleven. Uh Bam Bamford will start, mate. Um and Byron would probably start at right back, I think. I wouldn't say that mu much, mate. They drew the other day. Um so this is the championship in it. Um Oh, I mean, that'd be crazy, but I can't see it, mate. I think Southampton will come unstuck. They've got some very difficult games, to be honest. They they have to win every game. They have to win every game. Um, Southampton will be nine behind if we win tonight with two in hand and an inferior goal difference. Yeah, that's right. Is Gruev still out? Is everyone in agreement that we start with Gray midfield and Ampadu at the back? Yes, that would be... But I still think we'd be missing something because we need a six to play in there. Um... Melanie says, let's hold the Saints. Yeah, I think, if anything, I think they could increase it. But like someone said earlier in the chat, um, that um, someone said earlier in the chat that the Ipswich, you can never count them out. Big up Muck North uh, says, Joe, I'm presuming you're open for a Southampton win. The question is, if Southampton hold out, you'll be bouncing all over your room after the whistle before a ball is. Oh, Muck North, man. It doesn't matter, does it? Of course, like me celebrating Leicester getting beat has no bearing on the Leeds United result. It's only you that think it has a bearing on the Leeds United result. But if Southampton win, it's a massive plus for Leeds United, yeah, 100%. Um, Phillips coming back is too fairy tale. I wish it would work out, but I know it wouldn't and it would be sad. I think it would work out, but... Um, Brady is at the game today. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, yeah, there would have been an advert, mate. You might not have just seen it. Not everyone. I don't know people. I know the mic was on, bro. No worries. Um, James said, I take KP back for sure, depending on the price. He's definitely gone down in value. Yeah, of course there is, man. Um, yes, Mark. I would say it is, mate. I think this is the perfect result. Um, yeah, definitely. Yeah, this is true. This is true. If you say you do you, then why do you have a go at me, bro? It clearly wrangles a little bit. <laughs> hey, Joe, just want to say you're a top man and a top Leeds fan. Sick of the people online that ruin our players and ask for a change. You know your football, but no, so... Oh, big up to you, Connor Stanley. That means a lot, mate. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, the only thing we... Yeah, control the controllables. That's true. Um, that's it, Aaron. That's the That's the ticket, my man. That's the ticket. Jacob Greaves suspended for Hull, big loss for sure, big, big big loss. Like I say, we'll know their lineup in well, we'll know our lineup in twenty five minutes. That's the most important thing. Listen, folks, we're thirty likes away from nine hundred. So if you could uh, smash a like on the video for me, that'd be great. Please, please do do that for for me. Um, Joe, new to the channel, love it. Says Sandra Coppin. Big up to you, Sandra. Thanks for being here. Um, Gruyev is out. Where where have you... Nah, there's nothing out. There's, that's not been confirmed yet, Mikey. Doesn't follow football, Brian. So, yeah. <laughs> Ryan, do, do you actually think they're better than him? Just out of interest. Where's he said that, bro? 
Oh, Graham Smith, hang on. No sign of Gruyev with the squad. Fair play. Gruyev, he's out, folks. Ah. Sorry, I hadn't seen that, Mikey. Um, just so you can see it from the horse's mouth, folks. Thanks for Helen for tagging me in it. Um, you can see here, no Gruyev in the squad, um, which is disappointing. So that's going to be a big loss, you know. No sign of Gruyev. I'm a little bit more nervous now. I can't lie to you. Um, thanks, Leeds United, for tagging me in it, folks, for tagging me in it. It means a lot. Um, yeah. <laughs> Paul. Joe, is as is JT as nervous as he was against Watford? I don't know. Um, I'm not sure. We know what will happen, right? I think... Um, that Gruyev will go into midfield, but uh, sorry, Gray will go in midfield, but we'll have to wait and see how that transpires on the football pitch. Um, yeah, I think that's what it'll be, Helen. I think that's what it'll be. I, I, he won't play. He won't play Cooper again. Cooper was poor. I'd be very surprised anyway. I'm very surprised if he did play Charlie Crew in midfield. Yeah, maybe. Uh, Adam and Eve says good evening, Joe, and everyone else. Um, yeah, I look. I'm. I still back us for sure because all you've got to do is um, you've got to look at our performance when Ampadu and Rodon went to the back much better. So if we start with them at the back, then we should be fine. Um, we should be fine. E God though, I'm gutted about Gruyev. When do we play next Saturday? You'd hope that he's back for Saturday. Um, looks like the same squad. No sign of Gruyev off the coach. <laughs> yeah, Byron right back and Gray midfield. Yeah, I think that's what it'll be. Yeah, that's what I would go, Michael. That's what I would go. Andy says screen out of focus. Only for you, bro. Only for you, I think. Uh, I don't think Kamara went ghosting, mate. I don't think anyone was good. Too many people want to single out individuals. I think against Watford, no one was good. No one was good. Um, where do you get your stream from, Joe? It's Sky Sports, bro. Um, Sean says, as long as Cupid... <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this. But you are... Like, Cooper was not great. But he wasn't the only one. They were all shit. Let's be honest. They were all rubbish. Yeah, Vega, I hear what you're saying, bro. I've been told Cooper starts. I can't see it, Tommy. The fans will go into meltdown. If that is true, the fans will melt down. So sad for Cooper. It's been great saving for the club and we need Amps and Rodan at the back. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, I agreed with that as well. Creswell's good enough. We, I, I, but we haven't seen that, though. And who's going to play left centre-back? <coughs> who's going to play, play less left centre-back? No, definitely not. Who is P? Definitely not. He can't bloody turn when he's in space in the 10, so don't want him in a packed-out midfield even more so. So definitely not. <coughs> Um, let's have a look. To be honest, I do think Coots will start. I can't see it, Sam. I can't see it. I can't see it. And 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 if he did, and we lost, then you know, yeah, they were John. This is what people tend to forget. It's just like because boys are having a scrap. Um, get down, son. Get down. Anyway, we're getting ready for the second half. We'll focus on that lineup when it comes out in 19 minutes. Don't forget. Um, don't forget. Just waiting for the referee to blow his whistle for the second half. There we go. We're underway for the second half, folks. Hip switch behind Will Kenner, McKenna. Come up with a different tactical plan to get them back into this game. Uh, Strouk's out for the rest of the season, our kid. He's out. He 
he's a throw to come. Armstrong with the throw. Shea Adams. Come on, Southampton. Richo says, come on, Ipswich. No, we want the Saints, man. Juan Zabi. Oh. Uh, yeah, mate. Well, I've sent you a message. There should be a spot tonight for you if you if you uh, if you're about. David Lamb says I'll uh, I'll have a meltdown if Cooper starts. Yeah. Um, Nancy Frost and big game, but then the all now Leeds versus whole team news shortly. Uh, there you go. This game needs to be a draw. Nah, I, 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 um, I would prefer Southampton to win. I would prefer Southampton to win. Southampton have some very difficult games, um, and I don't see them winning them all. And they'd need to win them all, basically. Um, so I think, I think Southampton winning this helps us. My opinion. Um, good challenge. Southampton on the break here. Armstrong. He's got Fraser. Goes out to the right. Here's Stuart Armstrong. He's got Shea Adams to the right of him. Shea Adams. Oh, what is that? Terrible. Should have should have definitely created something. It's gone for a goal kick there. That was piss poor. Really poor. I think Stuart Armstrong, is it? Flynn Downs has took one in the chops. Uwe Rosler in, says Dylan. Do you think we should win? Who who do you support, Caden? Who do you support? It's Stuart Armstrong who's brought down. Who's brought him down here? Is it Luongo? They should have. They should have at least got a, uh, a shot on target from this. He's not back, Ross. He's not back. He's not with the squad. Yeah, I think you will win, mate. If you're a if you're a Saints fan, yeah, I think you will win. I think you will win tonight. For sure. Here's Hutchinson out to Leaf Davis. Leaf Davis. Cross. Back post, it's headed. Oh, good save by it was going wide anyway. Yeah, we'll be behind David Gray Babylon. Babylon, Babylon. Joe, when I said the screen, I meant the teams and our comments on your screen. Yeah, nah, they're not blurry though, bro. I can see see them on mine, so I don't I don't know if that's right, bro. I don't know. Here is um, Luongo. Not Luongos, Aribo. Uh, Armstrong lets it run. Here's Armstrong back to Bednarak. Bednarak's still got it. Here's Fraser. Great pass into Armstrong. He'll get wrong side of Twanzebi and actually win Southampton a corner. Decent. Yeah, Wilcox has been at the Saints for a while. He, he brought the Saints. Um, he. He brought the Saints players, uh, the City players with him, the likes of Bazunu and that when he, when they signed, didn't he? And what else was his name? Romeo Olavia before he went to um, before he went to Chelsea. So anyway, here comes the set piece, corner ball. Bree lifts it in, headed out by uh, Burgess, put back put back in there by Armstrong and again by Aribo. It's head tennis at the minute. Southampton have took the sting out of it and it goes into Bree. Don't forget to smash the likes, folks. Yeah, there's a clock up there, Clive. No, Lavia has been injured, hasn't he? Uh, 941 likes. Nine more likes for 50. Let's smash them likes, please. Um, 
Here's Jack Stevens. Shea Adams wants it off in the Rebo Central now, but it goes out wide to Adam Armstrong. Um, 50 minutes, yeah. Six more likes for 9.50, folks. If you haven't liked the video already, please do do that. We've had 1,100 viewers. Leads up next, remember. There will be an auto redirect on as well, so you don't need to adjust your TV screens. We'll just go straight on over. Here's Fraser up against Twan Zabie. <coughs> Jackson being done for a foul on Fraser. Decent area. It is a foul. He's complaining, but it is a foul. Yeah, picture is perfect, yeah. Nah, Alan, you don't, why do you, why do you, just genuinely, I'm not, why do you want Ipswich to win? Because then they're further away from us. Southampton, if they win, they still have to catch us. You know? I <laughs> love that. <laughs> Sorry, mate. Alopecia Trio, you'll have to come and fix it for me. It needs filling. Oh, I tell you what, that's a big save by Kladaki. Big up Ben Thorne. Great save. It's a good cross from Bree. And I think it might be Bednarak that flicks it goalwards. It is, but it's a it's a great save by Kladaki, that. Sounds like Victor Mouse. <laughs> I don't believe it. <coughs> Connor Chaplin's going to score, says Aaron. He's a good player. Corner ball. Headed out. By Burgess. Armstrong to Fraser. Either way, a draw. But I want Southampton to win. But if draw, then that's cool as well. So... At the minute, it's good because Ipswich would have to score two for us to be disappointed in this result. Armstrong strike! Ooh, I tell you what, that had some swaz. Some swing and swaz. Um, yeah, Southampton uh, on top, though. But they have been. They have been since... Well, they have been all game. Ipswich's goal came against the runner play, to be honest. So, 24 likes, folks, for a 1,000 likes. Big up. If you haven't already liked the video for me, please do subscribe as well as the uh, pin tweet, pin message there. Sorry, help me reach 28,000 subscribers. Subscribe now. Be part of that journey. Here's Armstrong giving it back to Armstrong. And that'll be another corner ball, folks. Turning the screw. Really turning the screw. <clears throat> 27,882. So a nine... No. Uh... 118 away from 28k, folks. If you could subscribe to the channel, that'd be greatly appreciated. Here's that Bednarak chance again. Great save by Kladaki. Looked like he's seen it late, to be honest. Corner ball. Yeah, Kiefer Moore went off injured, bro. Uh, Burgess won it again. Aribo's done. Oh, a chance. Shea Adams lifts it up. Oh, it's headed out, though, by Connor Chaplin. Brought down by Armstrong. Here's Bree, flicks it round to Fraser. Fraser's got the pace and the cross comes in, but it's headed out by Burgess. But Southampton again just camped on the edge of Le uh, Ipswich's box. Ipswich are at home yet. Yeah. Big up to you, Alan Robson. <coughs> <coughs> yeah. Moore's gone, mate, yeah. Over the top by um, Flynn Downs. No one on the end of it, though. Here's Wolfenden. Wolfenden out to Twanzebe. Morsi. Morsi lifts it. Forward for Ali Al Hamadi. He's going for an it switch throw. Ali Al Hamadi hasn't really done much, has he? Yeah, I could see Leicester going on a run, yeah, just because of their fixtures, mate.
just because of their fixtures. I think they've got Birmingham and Millwall next, so <laughs> you'd fancy them. I can't lie. Um, you would fancy them. Don't forget, we've got you covered on the Just Your Football Show. We do have some games to cover. Um, Norwich versus Ipswich Saturday morning and Coventry versus Leeds um, on Saturday afternoon. Fraser, uh, sorry, Armstrong with the block. Ten minutes played in this half, but uh, Southampton still massively on top for me. They look like they're only going to be one winner. Um, Baradi at the game tonight, yeah. Seen that. Well, Hamadi wants a free kick. Referee says no. Luongo tries to win it back, but here is Armstrong to Fraser. Fraser back to Jack Stevens. Uh, there'll be a post match, mate. There'll be a post match tonight. They want a penalty. Southampton. Referee says no. Chance. Oh, Jackson, his pass is poor, though, and it'll be dealt with there by Bree, and Southampton will come, come away. Chance. Go on, then, Flynn Downs. Play it to Armstrong. Oh, he's give it Fraser. Saved. Why didn't he pass it Armstrong? Why didn't he pass it Armstrong there? I think Armstrong should have... He should have passed Armstrong. It's 3-1 and it's game over. <coughs> Jason Wilcox to Manchester United. Looks like it's going to be a starter. Cross to come in, Armstrong is headed out. No one challenging for it. Easy for Burgess. Aribo puts it back in there. There's Morsi chasing, but Fraser. Bazunu. Goes out to Bree. A rebore. I think we're going to get some changes as well. There's about 32 minutes left. Yeah, Jason Wilcox played for us, yeah. Joe Second will do me. You don't care about winning the league. Yeah, I'm the same as you, Sandra. Genuinely, I'm not bothered. I know we're, I've said we'll win the league, and, and I think we will. But, like, if we don't, I'm not asked. Like, genuinely, I'm not asked. Give me second every day of the week. Just get me out of this division. I said this back in September as well, like, so... Hopefully it, it comes to fru fruition, you know? That was when Leicester were motoring. Obviously they faltered of late, but... Boys, what are you doing? Watch what you're doing, because there's wires and that there, bro. Start knocking stuff over and that, please... Robert's late fitness test. I don't know. I don't. I don't think uh, there's any shout of him being involved. I mean, it'd be great if Roberts played at right back, but it's the same squad, so I don't think he's with the squad, is he? Five minutes anyway, we'll find out. I think it'll be the same lineup, but you'll have Byram at right back. I think. I think so. Right, three changes. So you've got Harry Clark. You've got Broadhead coming on. Broadhead, decent. Yeah, Robert's out three weeks. Yeah, I did think so.
Twan Zabi coming off as well. I thought Harry Clark was injured, so fair play. Uh, Twan Zabi starting ahead of him. So you've got Broadhead, Taylor and Clark coming on. Free changes, Ipswich going for it. All Southampton, it has been, mate, it has been. So although Southampton director of football Jason Wilcock is prepared to quit, Man United hope a resolution can be found. Gardening leave is 12 months if he quits. Um, Wilcox has been offered technical director and wants the move. Of course he does. So Wilcox could be on his way to Manchester United. They've failed to agree compensa com compensation package following a disagreement over a buyout clause. United res Man United respectfully made an official approach to understand they offered a year's salary despite Wilcox being at Saints for nine months. So they offered to pay him his full because he only just left, didn't he? Um, technical director, big move for him, that. Oh, look, there's Big Ed, Ed Sheeran. Do you know he was actually born in Halifax? Ed Sheeran was actually born in Halifax. Callum says, have a feeling Ipswich steal something um, last minute. Listen, even if it's a point, don't matter, does it? Do you know what I mean? Hebden Bridge, was it Sam? Halifax, I think, no? Right. Yeah, maybe. Same thing. Same thing, same difference. Bednarak going off injured here, I think. I don't know if it's a sub or... We shall, we shall see. Yeah, close enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, lived there for about three weeks. We'll take it. We'll take it. I just remember because he got a Brit Award and they went from Halifax. And I was like, oh, hey. Oh, you're Ed. <laughs> Stuart Armstrong to take this throw. <coughs> One more minute, folks, for the lineup. Marco. Southampton dominating, aren't they? Ips, which haven't really created anything. Here's Leaf Davis. Taylor. Poor pass out to Clark. It's behind him. Let's see that lineup, folks. Get down, Marco. Thousand likes. Big up to you all. Let's keep smashing the likes on the video. Just waiting for that lineup. It's now 7 o'clock. Let's see what we've got, people. Yeah, yeah. Okay, here's the lineup, then, folks. No, no Gruyev out. Everyone expected. Melian goal. Byram at right back. Furport left back. Rodon and Ampadu at centre back. Gray and Kamara in midfield with Somerville, James, and Rutter, and then Bamford up top. Uh, the bench looks like this: Cal Darlow, Charlie Creswell, Liam Cooper, Jamie Shackleton, Charlie Crew. Jaden Anthony, Joe Gelhart, Joel Piro, and Matteo Joseph. There is your lineup for tonight. Cooper isn't in the squad. Oh, yeah, he is. He's on the bench. Um, those that say no, Joseph, Jesus, I don't know why. Bamford's great. But, yeah, there'll still be people annoyed. But um, Joseph has to just keep doing what he's doing. He has a part to play. He got us the equaliser. You know, he's, he's a great talent. But Bamford over 90 minutes every day of the week for me. So there's your lineup. Um, let's have a look what Hull City have got. Let's see their lineup for tonight, folks. I'll share the screen again. So, Allsop, Louis Coyle, Ryan Giles, Jones, Tufan, Tyler Morton, Jaden Philogene, uh, Seri, Slater, Carvalho, and Omar. Ryan Giles, obviously, uh, Tommy Coyle, Tufan, Tyler Morton, Philogene Seri, all decent players, Carvalho, of course, as well. Oh, chance, hit the post. 
They've hit the post. Ali Al Hamadi has just hit the post for Ipswich. He's just cannoned it off the post. There's the pass from Broadhead, and he actually goes inside, and it's a good strike, but it's off the post and out. But there's your whole Ipswich saying, we are not done yet. We are not done. Charlie Cruz earned his place on the bench. Yeah, he was. I hope he gets on. I'd love to see him get some minutes. It'd be class. But yeah, everyone's got to be happy with the lineup. Um, I think it's it's best we can we can hope for. Really, Gray will be in the middle of the park for sure. Just got to beat Hull City, haven't we? I think we will. To be honest, we best do. We need it. We must. We must, mustn't we? We have to. Broadhead. Challenged. Here's Flynn Downs for Southampton. Go down the right-hand side. He's not really got any support. There he goes back. Oh, it's gone out of play, has it? Yeah, it went out of play. It'll be an Ipswich throw. It will be an Ipswich throw. Uh, Chance, oh, shot on target. Chance, it's getting quite end-to-end -end now, folks. 23 minutes left. Good challenge by Bednarak to stop it going through to uh, Hutchinson. Here's a throw. Chaplin. Leif Davis. Broadhead. Broadhead scored. Wow. My God. Broadhead, man. Good player. Nothing lucky about that. It's decent. It's a decent effort. They were knocking on the door for the last five minutes. Draw's still good. Draw's still good, but I wouldn't bank on it staying like this. This is the problem. Southampton have had a lot of the ball, but they just don't create enough. And Paco Max bang on the money. Broadhead sub comes off the pitch. Comes on the pitch, sorry. It's Leif Davis' assist as well. Look, little cut back into Broadhead. Sorry, it's not. Oh, it's a good finish, that, by Nathan Broadhead. Bazunu, should he do, do better? I would argue, yes. I think he's a terrible keeper, to be honest. Let's have a look. Leif Davis, little pass in there. Oh, it's dog dirt. It's dog dirt, man. Dog dirt, two all. Yeah, Ipswich with the 96th minute winner is nailed on. Yeah, they fell asleep, man. Southampton garbage. Listen, if Southampton don't win, they, they, their automatic promotion ups are done, so they need to turn up. 22 minutes as well. We can't have Ipswich winning. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Ah! <laughs> Southampton have been the better side, though, as well. Davis tries a speculative effort. Broadhead, good challenge by Downs. Did you, this is what I'm saying. It's all good having possession, but if you don't create, or what does it matter? I created nothing. <sighs> That's a bad challenge, ref. Should be a yellow card there for Taylor. Taylor's ran off. He knows. I'm away. I'm away. I'm out of here. I'm out of here, he says. Get me going. Yellow card for Taylor. Yeah, it's a bad challenge. It's late. Some subs coming for Southampton now. Fraser coming off. He's fuming. David Brooks, though, good player. Come on, David Brooks, do it for your Welsh brothers. Come on. Oh, 
goes out wide. 20 minutes. We can't have Ipswich winning a draw is okay, but people, a draw is okay. Win, not so much. Bazunu, dodgy keeper, man. Dodgy keeper, I'm telling you. 1,050 likes. Don't forget to uh, smash a like on the video for me. He is Morsi. Bazunu, God. Dodgy keeper is rubbish, man. Jack Stevens from deep. Stuart. Adam Armstrong. Keep your comments coming in, folks. Southampton would be flying if they had a goalkeeper. Yeah, he's dodgy, isn't he? They will get a, a win in the 92nd minute. They always do. Maybe. Maybe. If they do, then, you know, you just have to... I don't know. Like... Just good, aren't they? <laughs> just good. <laughs> <laughs> They're just good, man. Can't deal anymore. Uh. Nineteen minutes left. Hip switch on top now, aren't they? Standard procedure. Big up to Colin Kerwin. Thank you, mate. He says, cheers, Joe, for all the coverage. Southampton just setting up for the playoffs. Leeds just need to win every game. That keeper is our Irish goalie. May as well put a scarecrow in goal. Thank you, brother. Leeds 3, Hull 1. I hope you're right, mate. Um, Ipswich have now got a set piece. Leif Davis stood over it. We know he can deliver a ball. He can finish as well by, uh, by the looks of the earliest chance. Can't defend, though. Here we go. In it comes. Boom. Bazunu, decent, decent throw that. Oh, that's terrible from, uh, I think it's Armstrong. Ipswich on top, I'm telling you. They're going to get a winner. I've done my build a bit for Leeds. Dan James, one shot on target, four corners, one card, over zero goals, and Archie Gray over 1.5 shots. There you go. Mustafa Khan says, win this game. Which game? Please leave Gavin alone. He's not great, though, Gary. What do you want me to do? He's not great. Is he? Um, Currently, mate, it would put them on live standings. It would put them on 85, yeah. That would put them on 85 with this result. If they win, then boof. If they win, it would put them on 87. And we'd need to win to go second. Sixteen minutes. What do you mean, Gabajan? Like, what kind of fucking logic is that, bro? What do you want us to do to lose? So people don't say we're unbeaten. I, I genuinely don't. This mental. If we weren't unbeaten, we wouldn't even be in the hunt. This is what is that? What does that even mean? I d genuinely, can you answer me what that means? What what's that logic? You sick of hearing about us being unbeaten, right? So let's lose then. Let's lose, and then you might accept third more. Eh? My God. Ipswich not prem quality. Well, if they win the league, they would argue not. They would argue they are. They need players, of course. And tell them, Andy D, this is what I'm saying. You cannot. Ball out to the left. Stuart Armstrong. Adam Armstrong into Stuart Armstrong. There's just so many Armstrongs. Safira Noah says Ipswich 27 to 10 to win, like printing money. Poor. 
I don't know. Are you going to go for it? Here they are now. Ali Al Hamadi. Where's the South? What are you doing? He's got to go left. He's got to go left. Oh, Chance Chaplin way over. He should have passed it. Big up, Jeremy. So wedding bells after hike, or are we left wanting asking for a friend? <laughs> Love that, mate. Probably, uh, yeah. Who knows? I'm going to send her that, though. I'm going to send it. I'll send it an Albro, and I'll let you know what she says. I've sent her it, so I'll let you know. <laughs> Big up to you, Jeremy. Thank you for the super chat, bro. 1,400 people watching, Legends. If you haven't already, smash a like on the uh, video for me. Here is Stuart Armstrong. Yeah, 1.4K uh, watching, smash a like. Live stream the wedding. <laughs> Imagine. Harry Clark has a chance to clear 30 minutes on the clock. Jeremy, she said, have you bought the diamond yet? And then she said, Jeremy knows the score. And then put a hair flick. So that sounds good, doesn't it? That sounds good, mate. <laughs> Jeremy knows the score. Oh. Chance a rebo. Chance, oh, cut back. Yeah, and ball! Oh, Southampton have got a score there. Have they not scored? Ball, cut back. Oh, God. Cross. No content for WrestleMania, mate. It's too... To be honest, I did Money in the Bank and it didn't do great and it's really late and stuff, so I would argue not. Um... J-Dog said would be amazed if there is no more goals in this. I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, if you get wed holds with house or telling facts looked after us very nice thank you Christopher I mean uh, I think it's been a little bit soon <laughs> um, if it's a trend and we lose I'm staying off oh don't Jamie don't it will be oh, honestly I can't cope if we do if that happens, man, imagine. <laughs> It'd be game over for social media for a week. A rebo. Come on, Southampton. Ten minutes left. Come on, the Saints. Chance. Adam Armstrong. Oh, a dozy. Can he keep it in? He can. Well done. Oh, cleared by Wolfenden. Throwing Southampton on top, though. Positive, at least. If you haven't already, folks, smash a like. We are uh, one away from 1,100, so please smash a like. Bednarak. Uh, 
A dozy. Oh, chance. Adam Armstrong, Adorzy again, heavily involved since coming on. Can he create something here? Up against Harry Clark, he's lifted it up, it's headed out. And again then by Morsi. Alhamdi moves it to Hutchinson. Amari Hutchinson is running at Howard Bellis. Carries the ball right into the final third. Oh, ball in. Cross, cleared, thankfully. So Aribo and Armstrong off. On comes Will Smallball and Joe Rothwell. Here's Hladaki. Here's Bender up. So we've got here is who's is that? Is it a Dorsey? No. Cross David Brooks finds space. Cross decent move. Oh, a Dorsey is in behind. Seven minutes left. Can they get a ball into the box? Southampton players queuing up. A Dorsey trying to get round Clark. Good feet. Nearly puts Clarks. Oh, had it. No. no good. Six minutes left. Draw. Want to draw at this point, don't we? We want to draw at this point. Let's hope it stays like this. Ladaki, six minutes left. Don't forget to smash a like on the video for me, folks. Adozi, Clark with a challenge, or he's offside, is Adozi. Davis. Oh, Breeze brought him down. Is it last man? It's not double jeopardy. Oh, he's gone. Bree has gone for Southampton. He brought down Davis last man. Pulled him down. I mean, he's put his hands on him. It's got to be done, hasn't it? It is a red. It is a red, like, because he's last man. If it's James Bree with the red card. Oh, there's only one team winning it if anyone does, right? Yeah. Leaf Davis gets the wrong side, does get round him, and he does pull him down, Bree, and he's last man. He's, he's through on goal. No double jeopardy because it wasn't a pen. Yeah, red card, rightly so.
anyone's getting a winner, folks, it's Ipswich. Uh, yeah, they probably will. You're right. Everyone's saying they're going to score. They are, right there. It's written. It's written. Don't forget to smash a like on the video for me, please, folks. Look at Ed Sheeran, man, you turncoat. You're from Yorkshire. <laughs> ah, Broadhead and Taylor over this. 1,139 likes, peeps. Taylor and Broadhead. Broadhead with the strike. Oh, it's well cleared. Small bone. Get after it, Brooks. Do it for Wales. Do it for Leeds. Davis, back forward. Bang. Smashed up field. Wolfenden goes back to his key pot. What You watch the referee put back 10 minutes on as well. He put seven in the first half, I swear, or eight, something like that. Slip from Hutchinson. Jack Stevens back to Bednarak. He is a dozy. Brought down, wins a free kick. Come on, Saints. A draw will do us. A draw will do us, folks. Russell Martin be fuming, won't we? Won't we? Small bone with the free kick. Headed out by Davis. Davis brings it down. Broad dead and him competing for the ball. It's four on three for Ipswich. Davis into Broadhead. Deflection. And uh, Davis has got it in the box. Davis looks to cut it back. Ooh, Chaplin always wide. He was offside. Leave Davis offside, folks. Panic over. Panic over. But Southampton so open. So open. 1,150 likes, folks. 50 more for 1,200. Please do that for me if you haven't already. 1,500 watching. Big up. Minute left. A, a, a draw's fine. Just don't give me an Ipswich late goal. I can't, I can't deal with this. Sammy Entos come on for Connor Chaplin. Obviously went on loan to Ipswich. There's Ed Sheeran again in crowd for Southampton. <laughs> Ed! <laughs> he supports two teams. Ball sent forward. Does anyone see that old deer there? She looked like Ed Sheeran. <laughs> Small bone with the throw. Last minute. Last minute, folks. Jeremy, I've just been told I've got to invite you to the wedding, mate. I've just been told I've got to invite you to the wedding, mate, if you're still in the chat. Okay? So there you go. Adorzy. Good feet. He's onside. Armstrong. Corner ball, Southampton. Come on, the Saints. 1,600 people watching. Big up to you all. Up the Saints. Oh, when the Saints go marching in. When the Saints go marching in, I want to be in that number. I want the Saints go marching in. Come on then, man. Five seconds of normal time. There will be some added time, though, for the red card and other bits and bats. Small bone to take. Where's the added time? Small bone. Crossed. Headed out. Easy for Burgess. He's done that all day. Seven minutes. Seven. Where's that come from, man? Uh. He 
Here is Leif Davis. Leif Davis goes over the top looking for the run of Al Ahamidi. He's got it in the box. There's one player in there, Hutchinson, but here's Broadhead. I really like Broadhead, you know. Leif Davis. Taylor. Wolfenden. Harry Clark wants it out on the right. He's giving it him. Will a ball come in the box? It will. It's deep. Davis headed infield, but Smallbone's there to clear. Six minutes left, folks. Come on, <laughs> How bad is this, man? Fuck's sake. Oh, Samiento falls over. Love that. Smallbone. Smallbone then gives it into Bree. Oh, Bree. Bree's not even on the pitch. Flynn down, sorry. It's a haircut, man. Oh, a doors it. Manages to come away with the ball. Could be a chance here for Southampton. Nice little touch. Move it on then. Move it on. Well done. Here's Smallbone, Voldemort. Downs back into Smallbone. Smallbone's going to switch it out to. A dozy, a dozy's touch keeps it in. Well played, son. Up against Hutchinson. Brooks. Oh, he's tried to cross, but it's blocked by Wolfenden. Now it's Ipswich pending. Come on, Southampton. Down to 10 men. Five minutes left. Oh, nice. Brooks. Cross. Oh, he nearly puts it in his own net. But it's a corner ball. Wolfenden there on the cover. Davis had been beaten. Good football there between Brooks. I'm not sure who, who, who played the return pass. There's an argument for offside, but it's decent. And uh, Wolfenden stops it, and it'll be a corner ball to Southampton. Leave Davis is down. It's all good, man. It's his time, isn't it? It's their time. He's got a bit of cramp, I think. He's got a bit of cramp, folks. I'm a Leeds United fan, Reese. John says, what do you know about goalkeeping? You couldn't keep chickens. What's that What's that got to do with price of fish? I don't know if you're talking to me me there, by the way, but you might be talking to someone else, but I don't know what goalkeeping and chickens has got to do. I reckon chickens are quite hard to, to keep as well, to be fair. Do you reckon? I reckon they could be. Anyway, if you haven't already, folks, smash a like on the video. 1,186, 14 away from 1,200. Let's get them likes smashed. Remember, straight after this as well, we've got your Leeds United stream. Leeds take on Hull City at home. I'm, I'm quite glad how this last seven minutes has gone because I thought it would all be... I thought it would all be Ipswich, but um, Southampton have, have come to the party, so... Here's the throw. Here's a dozy who's called problems since coming in. Morsi has a chance to clear. Morsi clears. Oh, God, it's going to fall here. And Ali al Hamadi. Oh, that's a red. That's Oh, that's a great challenge by David Brooks. This is another red, surely. Bednarat with a yellow. How's that not a red, though? Just out of interest. How's that not a red? Because that he was through on goal. No? Oh, no, he's not. Yeah, he is. That's a red. How's that not a red? I'm confused. Is that not a red card, though? Genuinely, just out of interest, like, or are they saying that Brooks should have got there? Maybe Brooks gets there so he's not last man, but he's took one for the team there, Bednarak. I can't lie to you. Three minutes at a time. Two. Down to two now, by the way. Down to two. Down to two. Two minutes left. Morsi over the free kick. If anyone's going to win it, it will be Ipswich because we know that's how it's written, isn't it? But Davis. Davis pops it up. Headed back across. Oh, Bednarak. Broadhead. Oh, Bazunu somehow saved it. <laughs> Come on, Southampton. Howard Bellis. Clips it up to Adam Armstrong. He's lost it, though. Samiento does well. There's Davis. Back to Burgess, who goes back to his keeper, Hladaki. Got about a minute and a half, folks. I 
Sammy Ento, back to Harry Clark. Don't forget to smash those likes, folks. 1,200, big up to you all. Great, great numbers today. On both streams, we've got one more to go as well, and it's the big one. It's Leeds versus Hull. Here's Leave Davis. Leave Davis pops it into the box. It's got to be hell. Oh, well done, Bedner Rack. Heads it into Bazunu's path, and there's a minute left. A minute left. <laughs> Try to contain the excitement. <sighs> Come on, Southampton. Hold on. Hold. Bazunu goes long with his kick. Oh, as the bounce beat him, it's straight through to Hladaki. 30 seconds left. He goes into Harry Clark, rolls it out to Harry Clark. Morsi wants it from him. Harry Clark will pass it into Morsi. Morsi turns, runs into the space. Stuart, Adam Armstrong tries to bring him down, but Morsi's found Leif Davis. Why is he in that much space when you've got a minute left? Davis! Oh, he's fallen over! Broden! No! What the f It's Sami Ento! Why? Why is he in that much space? Southampton, you are a joke, by the way. I'm sorry. Ipswich, fair play. Can you believe that on the 97th minute? Southampton, you are a joke. How can you leave that much space? How can you leave that much space for him? Mental that. That is mental. Mental, man. Sami Ento brought in in January. Look at that. Why is Davis in that much space? It is mental and he's crossed it. He's fallen over. He's fallen over, Sami Ento. Managed to get back up on his feet and then find the corner. Southampton, shocking. Southampton out at top two now for me. How has he done that? Torpok decided it. They do it again. Mental. I didn't, Davis totally unmarked. Mental, that man. Davis assists, goals. Oh, my God. Wow. That is mental. Mental. Um, one second. I just need to... This is mental. I can't believe that's happened, you know. Unbelievable finish. Unbelievable. Sorry, I was just responding to uh, to Jack just because he's got my ticket. Um, and he's just having a few ticket issues while he's at the ground. Um, so I've just messaged him. Sorry about that. Yeah, listen. Wow. What a turn up for the books. Um, Southampton dominated. But yeah, um, that's Southampton done for top two now anyway. So... That's on them, innit? See, see you later. Um, Leeds United must win now. Leeds United have to win um, because, yeah, otherwise it's it's not looking good, is it? So, um, yeah, we've got to win. We have to win now. Um, how's the nerves, folks? <laughs> this is what we're in it for, though, right? 
Um, this is what we're in it for. This is what we are there for. Listen, um, Sami Ento. Listen, the, as well, Ipswich have done some good deals. They bring on Al Hamadi. They bring uh, they bring in Sami Ento. There you go. No key for more, though. They've got Norwich up next. They shouldn't have won that. Well, nah, listen, they, they went on and won the game amazing. In the last minute, it almost feels inevitable that Ipswich will go up. At this point, like, it feels like it's inevitable that they'll go up. So, between us and Leicester, ugh, it's not looking good, bruv. <laughs> yeah, what what can you say? A dagger through your heart. A dagger through my heart as well. I can't lie to you. Um... Wow. Uh, anyway, right, okay. So, I have started the other stream now. I've started the other stream. So, when this one ends, we're going to go straight on over uh, to the Leeds United one. It's Leeds United versus Hull. It's a must-win game. I'll see you in two. Don't adjust anything. You'll just be taken straight over there. See you in a sec, folks. I am shifting it. 